I miss going out with you on Saturday night. I think it would be good for us to go out one night a week where it's just you and me. I think you it would be healthy. You're kidding me. What? You just checked out that girl's butt. How are you guys? Very Doing good, great. thank you. That's fantastic. I want to congratulate you with this film. It's freaking funny. Oh, thank you. There's a really, really sweet core at its heart. Yeah. Yeah, there yeah. has to be. Yeah. We, 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 that, we try to do that, you know. It, 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 all the jokes work better if there's something, if there's a sweet story underneath it. And in this one, you know, we get these two married guys and uh, they have the beautiful wives, but they all, you know, they, they split up for a week and at the end they, they kind of all come back together in a, in a good way. Now, what attracted you guys to making the film? We love the concept. Pete Jones wrote the original draft and we got it, we thought it was a very funny concept and we ha it had a lot of laughs. And, and then we rewrote it with them, and actually the first draft that we finished, we gave to our wives, and they hated it. They said, this is ridiculous. And because at that time, the guys had the hall pass, and the wives sat around biting their fingernails, like wondering what would happen. And my wife said, wait a second. If you get a hall pass, I get a hall pass. And that kind of opened it up for us. We started seeing it differently, and, and, and that changed the entire movie. I'm giving you a hall pass. A what? A what? A what? A hall pass. Just you and me, buddy, for the next six days. <laughs> Let me log out. Okay, you log out. I'm gonna try to bang a receptionist. There are two favorite scenes of mine. Guess which ones are those? <laughs> I'm going to say the hot tub scene. <laughs> Very good. It's quite inspiring, let me tell you. And the other and one, then, and then the yeah. hot tub scene again? Yeah. <laughs> no, the bathtub or the bathroom yeah, scene. Right. I, I cracked up. Oh, yeah. It was so funny. <laughs> well, uh, I'm very proud of that scene because we had a good head fake with the bucket. You know, you were looking one way, you weren't expecting the other way. I also learned a lot. Yeah. I learned fake chow. Who knew there's such a thing? Yeah. The snapshot. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> These are all things you can use in your life. And that um, air supply can be quite soothing. Yes, yes, <laughs> absolutely, yeah. How did you guys come up with jokes like that? Well, I guess, you know, we surround ourselves with, with funny people and we try to, you know, remember things that happened and, you know, try to work them into the movie. So uh, we owe it to other people, too. <laughs> I'm not sure Applebee's is the best place to meet hot, horny women at. What do you think, an Olive Garden? I'm not gonna let you guys go without giving me a little hint of Three Stooges. Yeah. Three Stooges is finally uh, uh, going. We're in pre-production now. We don't know who's gonna be in it, but we've been looking at a lot of fantastic people. And we hope to have it out in uh, sometime 2012. But, you know, it's, it's definitely going. It's, what it is is, by the way, it's not a biopic. It's three... 25-minute episodes that we've written. Each episode picks up where the last episode left off. So it's just like the show you watch, uh, but three of them attached to each other, all new material. I am looking forward to that. Thank you. Um, also, my DJ in uh, Palm Springs, uh -huh. he's from Rhode Island. Oh, yeah, and he's got a special question. Providence. Uh -huh. He's got a special question. He said, ask them about the monster that lives in Diamond Hill by Cumberland, where yeah. you guys said, are you going to make a movie out of that? Is that <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we live, we live like a, a half the a mile. The monster that lives in Diamond Hill? Yeah. Is, is it wow. true there's such a thing? Uh, I think it's, a, it's like Bigfoot. You know, some people think there is. <laughs> but <laughs> he, he went. There we grew a, up right near yeah. Diamond Hill. Yeah. We've seen him a few times, the Bigfoot up there. Oh, so documented. Yeah, but Diamond Hill is a great, a great part of, we grew up half mile from there. We call him Big Dong uh, the, uh, next to Diamond Hill. Yeah. <laughs> that will be the title of the film. Yeah. We'll come back to Palm Springs soon. Yes, and absolutely. Thanks a lot. We get down there a lot because our parents are down there. They're in a desert, uh, Palm Desert. And we'll play penny machines in one of those Indian casinos. Absolutely. <laughs> okay. Thank Thanks you, guys. Very nice to meet Thank you. you. Thank you. Thanks okay. so much. Thanks. Blonde, right here. She surrounds herself with less attractive women to make her look like a 10. Hot. Nah. That's amazing. You're like a beautiful mind. 